it is that time during holiday season where we're exposed to so much that everyone is doing. And I mean, in terms of spending or amassing material things, whether it's sneakers, whether it's electronics, whether it's clothes, whether it's cars, whether it's houses, it doesn't matter. We're exposed to a lot, right? We're, we're no longer just exposed to the Joneses next door. It's everyone in the world that happens to be on social media. It can be in our close circle. It can be family. It can be friends. It can be acquaintances. It can be internet friends. It doesn't matter. You're exposed to a lot right now. And when it comes to young adults, I don't want you to think, especially when it comes to you viewing me, and I can only speak for myself, somebody that happens to be in the sneaker YouTube lane, don't think that I need to be exactly where they are with the amount they are right now. Because as much as I want you to grind to get to whatever level you want to be, whatever contentment you feel you want for, for life, because it's okay to want things, there's levels to life. There's levels to income. There's levels to how long you've been collecting in terms of sneakers. And if you rush that to get to someone else's level, and ignore the one that you're on, especially in terms of income, it can wreck your entire world. I surround my soul with the positivity. That's why I don't worry about the things that I don't see. Yeah. These days I don't worry about much. I think we should have some more fun. I still dream about the days when we were young. I'll take a hit and still finish and I won. Everybody, it's your girl TJ back with another video talks with TJ aka TJ Two Shoes Chains. This will be a short one, but hopefully you guys are having an amazing day. Uh, if you are brand new, hit the subscribe button, hit the like button. Two Shoes Crew, thank you guys again for always tuning in to this video. And it's certainly just going to be a discussion video. All right, I don't have anything to show you. I promise you've seen enough. You've seen a lot on this channel, and I do have more things on the way that you know I'll, I'll share with you because that's what we do here. I hope that whatever I may like or my style or my interests or my pickups might encourage you, hey, test this out, try this, I might like this, I never thought to pair this with this. That's great, that's well and good, but I know more than ever, right, with social media holiday season, it used to be, oh, we just see what our friends or our family, you know, received or what they have because we went over their home, we, we went to their houses around the holiday time and that was it, okay, to play with toys or you were on the same team together, you went to school together, so you were able to see what somebody got in terms of shoes, clothes, whatever, right? Because we all buy junk that we don't need, so whatever. But now it's different. You're exposed to everyone and everything on social media, and I can only imagine for young adults as well that are really into sneakers, and I can really only speak to kicks because that's what we focus on here. I can only imagine young adults that are watching myself, you're watching other larger uh, YouTube creators, and you see the collections, you see all the shoes behind us, you see, well, you don't see tons of shoes behind me unless in my closet, but you see all the shoes behind us, you see pickup after pickup after pickup after pickup. First off, there are agendas for some of that, right? Like, keep in mind, the point is to have product in front of you all to grow for most creators, so it doesn't necessarily mean that product is staying in house with them, but they're getting it out in front of you and they're receiving the view. That's the point, right? Get the view, move along. So don't assume the shoe is necessarily kept. That's just one thing. Number two, whatever your level, whatever goals you're striving to hit right now, whatever your income is more importantly, that's what you need to operate within. Same thing with your collection, okay? Wherever you are, operate within that. I don't want young adults to simply view me and you may think like, oh, you're going back for OGs. Like I, I went, I, you know, or better retros, right? I'll just put it like that, like uh, grill retros. I went back earlier this year and I picked up the 2011 Air Jordan 3 White Cement and I was able to go back and pick up the Obsidian, you know, anniversary for the Air Max 1. So you may see me go back and pick up shoes and then you'll see me pick up new shoes and new clothes. And you think, okay, that's exactly where I wanna be and that's the level I wanna be at. So I'm gonna go after it. But if you're not at that level, that's fine. Understand this, I have friends that are at different levels than what I am, right? For me, it may be nothing where I choose to allocate and budget three to $500 or something a month, okay, to treat myself. And based on their income levels, it may be the same percentage of their income to drop 5,000 to 6,000 or something on themselves. And that's nothing to bat an eye at because it's their level and it's what they are at in life. 
you have to operate within your own. And it becomes difficult to do that when you're seeing so much in front of you. Young adults already rush to get to wherever their parents were in a shorter amount of time. So you see what your parents have right now. And you think, okay, I gotta get this house with this many bedrooms, this many bathrooms, and be able to do X, Y, and Z for everyone that I know because your parents are doing it. Okay, well, your parents have probably been at this for 20 some plus years. That is time in which they've grown income, uh, that they, they've changed their approach, right? Everything may be different, but it was a timeline. And I don't want young adults to speed up their own timeline. I, I don't. Operate where you are right now. So don't watch sneaker YouTubers and think, man, they just showcased like five shoes this month. Like, why am I not there? Why am I not doing that? Because you may not be at that level and that's okay. Don't feel forced to be at a level that you're not. If you're gonna, first off, you should never only be surrounded by people that are doing the exact same thing as you at the exact same level. You want people that are doing greater. And you may have friends that you love and care about and they are not exactly at the level you are. That's fine. No matter what, whether somebody's making $8 an hour, $25 an hour, $25,000 an hour, you should treat them the same, okay? Same respect, same human decency, um, same understanding, right? Same empathy. But you still have to have enough self-awareness to not rush yourself because that leads to insecurities. It leads to poor life choices. And I don't want you to put yourself in a position where it's not that you are selling, let's say your sneaker collection now because, oh, it just doesn't make logical sense to hold on to certain pairs. You will then put yourself in a position where you're selling because you have to, you don't have a choice. You backed yourself into a corner. You're now in credit card debt and you, you can't take care of necessary life expenses all because you were trying to keep up with so-and-so. You don't know so-and-so's situation. You don't know the factors that people have to, 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 to account for in life. And it's also their level, it's not yours. So I just want young adults, keep that in mind this holiday season. I know it's difficult. You're gonna see creators get up here and they will show you every single release coming out this holiday season, every single one. And they're also showing it to you early, which means they possibly are paying more for that shoe just to get it in front of you. And so you think I have to do the exact same thing. You don't, especially if you're not at that level right now. Wherever you are, maximize that. Maximize that. Paying off debt, still saving, treating yourself, you know, within reason. Do that. I would at least feel a little more I would at least feel better about you guys doing that, especially if you're watching me, okay? Respect the level you, you're at, respect the income you're at, grind to get to the next level of where you wanna be, but have patience in doing it. Don't be so focused on everything else you see, all right? Hopefully this helps some young adult. As always, extra age, nurse your shoe size, peace out.